saying I'm running because of the word. I'm running by the word. I'm running by the word. I can see nothing. But I'm running by the word. Let me tell you that word that you're running by is God Himself. The word of God says in the beginning was the word and the word was God and the word was with God. Welcome Banirisa. to the company Mubantu. of the people Abo. who are the pleasers of God. Katonda. If you are going to get it, Bifuna. he will hide it from Again, you so that you can please him. I pity those who run away because they haven't seen it yet I pity those who get frustrated because they haven't seen it yet Jesus said yes, to Thomas the doubter Thomas, you have Thomas. believed because you have seen but blessed is he blessed is he who believes without seeing who believes without seeing who believes without seeing John chapter 11 verse 40 it is about believing for the glory of God it is about believing then Jesus said did I not tell you that if you believe you would see the glory of God not if you saw but if you believe, you would see the glory of God. I am here to tell you, those of you who are waiting for the glory, who are waiting for the cloud, all you need is the word. All you need is the word. Run by the word. Run by the word. Run by the word. The man of God. Surround me. Whenever I went to the prophet, he would tell him I see nothing. The prophet would tell him, Don't look at me. Go back to the river. Go back to the river. Go back to the river. He would run around. Go by the word. He would run around. Running, running on the word. There were three times. Running. Turn to your neighbor and say, I see nothing. I see nothing. I see nothing. It's so hard. Like calling you out. When you're a pastor's wife. The fire what? A clock. Hey, a clock. Hey, a clock. The prophet came through. Even the little I had was destroyed. I see nothing. This is the right place to see nothing. Because all you need at the river is the word plus nothing. For God to give you a marriage, you need nothing. For God to give you a money, you need nothing. For God to give you a lifestyle, you need nothing. But the word, plus the word, plus the word. Tell the person next to you, see in a chenda ba. Kati temperature genda kuchuka. Now the temperature is about to change. Number musamvu a yingi deo. Number seven has shown up. Number musamvu a yingi deo. Number seven has come. Number musamvu a yingi deo. Number seven has come. If you can put that scripture for me. Tere chandi kibwecho. 
at the at the seventh time. The seventh time. The servant reported. Where is Anagamba? At the seventh time. I tell you the temperature has changed. Number seven has come in. Number seven has come in. Number seven has come in. The man of God came and said, Boss, things have changed a bit. Number seven has come in. I see a small thing. I see a cloud. It is small in the form of a human hand. I see some glory. A little bit. It is like the hand of a man. Brethren, 77 days came to Uganda to change the temperature. To change the temperature. To change the temperature. To change the temperature. This is your season. This is your time. This is your season. This is your time. Seventy-seven days. Has come to change your season. He told him, I see a cloud. I see a cloud. It is not like it's been. When number seven came in, things began to change. I see something. I see something. I see something. Brethren, 77 days has brought something. Don't doze. Look carefully. The temperature has changed. You are seeing nothing. Go back and look carefully. Some things are forming. Some things have begun to happen. Some things have begun to happen. Some things have begun to happen. Tell your neighbor number seven has come in. Seven is the number of completion. He made seven days and he rested. Number Nagamba He told him, I've seen it. That means whatever you see in 77 days, magnify it. He saw a small thing, but he went back and told him I see something. He has not yet formed it to something. But I see something. I see some small thing. I see something small. Number seven has come in. Brethren, look carefully. Things are not like they were. He went back and reported that I see something now. Now I want to tell you something amazing. I expect it is the message. Elijah, Elijah had not seen anything. But the servant is the one who went and testified to Elijah. The servant is the one who had received the cloud. Elijah just had the, the servant testifying to him those who don't know Luganda, let me repeat it for you. Elijah had Eri. not seen the cloud. He just had a testimony from the servant. But he decided. That if it is, it, I 
has happened to him. It is about to happen to me. If he has seen it, I'm about to see it. I am here to tell you today. They overcame him by the blood of the Lamb and the word of their testimony. Don't wait for it to happen to your house. Begin to run. Begin to run because you have seen it happening to other people. You have seen it happening to David. You have seen it happening to Abema. You have seen it happening to other people. Don't wait to see it. If someone tells you there is a cloud, it means the whole of Uganda is about to see it. Because the cloud does not appear to one eye. The cloud appears to everybody. You haven't yet understood me. You have not yet understood what I'm saying. Elijah, Elijah was hiding somewhere. He had covered his eyes. The servant came back and told him, Master, my issues are well. It is not big that I have, but I've seen it. Elijah told him, let's go by that. Let's walk by your miracle. Let's walk by yours. I'm not going to remain seated. If the glory is upon you, I am going to receive it as well. I'm going to receive it too. Brethren, ask the person next to you, have you received something? If you received something, let us walk by what you've received. Let us walk by what you've received. What you have received, it proves that my miracle is about to come. My miracle is coming. He told him, I tell you, let us get up. Let us run. Because the rain is coming. Because the rain is coming. I will not wait to see the cloud. Let me get ready. I will see it as well. Let us go by your word. Let us go by your miracle. Let us go by yours. Let us go with yours. If yours hasn't come, let us go by Abema's miracle. If your miracle hasn't come, let us go by Abema's miracle. If your miracle hasn't come, let us go by Abema's miracle. If your miracles are coming, let us go by what we can see. Jesus. He told him, let us go by what you see. Let us go by what you see. He told him, we are not remaining here. This is a time of rejoicing and celebrating. This is a time of showing the king the rain has come. This is a time to prove that our God works. If it could happen to your neighbor, that means it shall happen to you as well. When the angel visited Mary, and she said, I'm a virgin, how can this be? The angel told her, Your cousin Elizabeth, who was once buried, is now with child. And she said to him, to her, Don't sit down. Don't sit down waiting for what belongs to you. What a prophesy to you. Just run immediately. Go to Elizabeth. And see it with your eyes. What I've done in her house. They go to visit her. That old woman. That one woman. That barren woman. Is the God who has visited you too. He said, let us go by your word. Let us go by what you've said. Let us go by that. Let 
Look at the person next to you, tell them a miracle. That a miracle. Your miracle We shall walk by it We shall run by it Because your miracle Proves and shows That mine Is about to come Mine Is about to run to me That is why The person who is mature in the spirit Never be jealous of your neighbor A mature spiritual person Never be offended when somebody is Mature people in the spirit. They don't follow competition. That let me silence this one. That they may not show me. That they may see me. What shall you do? When my time comes. When my cloud has come. What shall you do with it? What shall you do? What will you do? You are getting jealous. Do you know the time I spent going to the river? When the world was looking to see my miracle. When kings were waiting to see a miracle. When I had nothing to show. Now my time has come. You're busy getting offended. Never be offended. When it happens to me, that means it's coming to you too. Shake it. When you see somebody as you see something, Goduka. just run. Goduka. Run. Goduka. Tell them Kongs. Yes, congratulations, Abemaka. I bless you with some money. Because mine, I'm also coming. I'm also coming. I'm also coming. I'm also coming. Never be jealous. Never try to cover it up. Never try to copy. Because the person you copy, their cloud is small. It is like the hand of a man. Elijah said, What you've received proves to us that something big is coming, that something great is coming, something that will show Israel is coming. He told him, let's go by what you see. He told him, let's run by what you see. He told him, let's run by that. Brethren, I feel like running. I feel like running. Because what I've seen is a lot. Let me run by those. Let me run because of 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 those. Elijah. 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 Namugamba. Told him. By your cloud. We shall hit the king. I will not wait to see mine that is king. Because what, what is it? We shall go to the king. He told him rise up. Go tell the king. That the rain is coming. Try to hurry up. The rain will catch up with you. Because of your small cloud, we shall speak because of that. Because of your cloud, we shall believe. the servant or the man of God did as Elijah instructed him and he ran to God to, to the king tell him that the rain is coming the prophet said because of my cloud it is enough to prove that the rain is coming Elijah remained in this place but after he said why should I remain behind 
How can I sit when my neighbor sees something? The anointing of running. The anointing to run. Caught up with Elijah. Hold on, stand still and listen. Stand and listen to this. Elijah. He said, Let me participate in this. The cloud is for the bright. I too will not sit down because this cloud shows that something is coming for him. He also rose up. See what he did. He ran fast. He outran the one who had seen the cloud because the clouds were dark. The rain had begun to fall. The clouds were dark. When his cloud showed up, he received the anointing. He ran faster than the one who had to see the cloud. That's why I say to you today the clouds you see this morning, let them intimidate you. There is an anointing that is able to catch up with you and you run faster than those who went ahead of you. But you run and outrun those who went ahead of you. You run outrun those who went ahead of you. Yes. And you run and outrun those who have visited before you. And you run and you outrun those who receive miracles you run and you outrun them Elijah ran he outran his colleague who had seen the cloud do not be dismayed I declare the anointing to run of running the anointing to run to outrun those who went ahead of you to receive miracles I declare the blessing to run and pass those who went ahead of you the anointing of running caught up with Elijah and he ran he ran he ran he ran by the time he realized the person who saw the cloud before him he had left him behind let them go ahead of you let them go ahead of you but your big cloud when it comes you will run and you will not run and go faster your cloud when it comes you run and go ahead of them when you cloud when it comes you run and go ahead of them don't worry coping don't, don't pretend to be great your cloud when it shows up you will run and you go ahead of them he didn't struggle he was not in a race he didn't say Lord help me to win them he realized he had outrun the king even the servant he said where are the people who saw the cloud his cloud had shown even the rain had begun to fall he realized how comes a pastor you will be far from them those who went ahead of you you will be far away from them those who went ahead of you you will be far from them those who went ahead of you you will lead them don't hustle by crying don't dare envying them stand upon the word run on the word don't leave the river come back and peep come back and peep come back and peep come back and peep because number seven has become something this is a time this is your time this is your time he ran. He ran. He ran. He ran. Faster than the servants. Faster than him. And he went ahead of him. The one who had seen the one who first saw the cloud. The one who first saw it. The one who had their small cloud. Ran. When he speaks, when it showed up, 
Cause a small cloud. Gave birth to something great. The glory does not have a reversible effect. The glory has a multiplicity effect. The Bible says from glory to glory. If you see something, that means something greater is coming. That means something else is coming. That means something great is coming. The glory of God. It doesn't reverse. If you've seen it upon your friend, just know what is coming to you. It's greater than what you saw. The glory has a multiplicity effect. From glory to glory. From glory to glory. From glory to glory. From glory to glory. Now you're going to start praying. Saying, Lord, your word. And my nothing is what I brought. I've combined them that you may turn them into a miracle. Your word plus my nothing is what I've brought. I will not be discouraged because I've not seen nothing. Lord, your word plus my nothing is what I've brought. I'm not offended with people. I'm not involved in competition. I'm not into struggles. I'm no longer into envious business. I'm no longer into struggles to quench people. Why are you quenching people? Clouds are different. This may be a small cloud. Maybe you went ahead of me. But let me wait for mine. Let me wait for my own cloud. Let me wait for my cloud. Let me wait for my cloud. I may run. I may run. I may run. Faster than you. And I go ahead of you. Faster than you. Time wasted. Time spent believing God. Is never time wasted. Time spent waiting on God. Is never time wasted. They that wait upon God. He shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings as eagles. They shall walk. And not grow weary. They shall run. And they shall not fall. Stand on the word. Psalm chapter 29 verse 3. When you go to the river, stand on the word. Psalm 29, verse 3. Verse 3. The voice of the Lord is over the waters. The God of glory thunders. The Lord thunders over the mighty. If you can hear the voice on the waters, that is better than seeing. Deuteronomy chapter 5. I think it's verse 24. The Lord our God has shown us his glory and his majesty and we have heard his voice. The Lord our God has shown us his glory and his majesty and we have heard his voice. Not that we have sinned but we have heard. If you want to see the glory of the Lord, just hear the voice of the Lord. If you want to see the majesty of the Lord, hear the voice of the Lord. Elijah said, I hear the sound of an abundance of rain. My brothers, my sisters, abundance is coming Gujia. abundance Omunji. is coming Gujia. abundance Omunji. is coming Gujia. abundance Omunji. is coming Gujia. all you need to do Chiweta go kola choka. is to hear
Tell the person next to you. I will not copy you again. I will not compete with you again. I will not try to put you down. Walk by your cloud. Let me wait for my own cloud. But the anointing to run. When it falls on me. You realize it. The anointing to run when it falls on me. You realize it. The Lord our God has shown us his glory and his majesty. And we have heard his voice. The glory of the Lord is birthed by the voice. The glory of the Lord is produced by hearing. The glory of the Lord is not produced out of copy. The glory of the Lord is not birthed out of competition. Once you copy it, then it's no longer glorious. They say we saw it upon so and so. We also saw it upon so and so. But because when someone, this one was using it, it was a little different. Tell your neighbor I'm waiting for the real cloud. Father in heaven, we come to you in the mighty name of Jesus. We praise you. We glorify you. We recognize ourselves as unique individuals. Each of us called for something else. And we stand waiting for your glory. We stand waiting for your visitation. Father, we hear your voice. And we know, we know, we know the word that was that, that was given for us. And we will run according to the word until number seven. Until number seven. And Father, we believe for the anointing to overtake. We believe for the anointing to overtake. Start running now. As you pray for the anointing of overtaking, you may have stayed for a long time. You may have stayed there for a long time to receive your miracle. But pray for the anointing. To overtake, to overtake those who are in the Maybe you've been there for a long time. Pray for the anointing that fell upon Elijah. That your cloud, when it shows up, that you will overtake those who went ahead of you. That you will overtake those who compete with you. That you will overtake those who are ahead of you. Come on, come on, open your voice. This is a night like you have never seen before. You get an Lift your voice and speak. Oh, come here, Lord, I see the cloud. Oh, come on, I see the cloud. I see the cloud. Come on, Duka. Duka, run. Duka, 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 Duka. Keep on running. Duka, 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 Duka. Keep on running. Say, I see the cloud. Duka we toro lenga bo gane mirundi musambo la mirundi musambo. I see the cloud. 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 In the name of Jesus.
hand of the Lord is revealed by His voice. When our hearts hear His voice, His glory is here for all to have a moment to see His power. Oh
his voice. When our hearts hear his spirit, his glory is here for all to have a moment to see. He is The hand of the Lord is revealed by his voice. When our hearts hear his spirit, his glory is here for all to have a moment to see. His power, the hand of the Lord, is revealed by His voice. His glory is here for all to have a moment to see. His power. See you. 
hand of the Lord is revealed by His voice. When I hear His Spirit, glory is here for all to have a moment to see His power. the faint, faint speak. Let the faith of the saints speak. Let the faith of the righteous walk and receive the wonders of our God and receive the miracles of our God and receive the healing we need and receive the joy of the Lord mm. and the
thank the Lord has given us another song. Now we're going to anoint you with oil. What a message. I see nothing, but I hear the rain. Many of you, probably when we started 77, you've not seen what God has prophesied to you. But I'm here to tell you, it is coming to you in abundance. It is coming to you in abundance. Father, anoint this oil. As it's going to anoint your people. It will be a miracle. When Pastor Jessica was preaching, I got a revelation. May God deliver you from every bondage, from every attack of the enemy, from every power of witchcraft. Be free in Jesus' name. Listen to this child of God. This is what I got in the spirit. Oh, be free. Be free in Jesus. This is what I got in the spirit. In the mighty name of Jesus. That he saw the hand a cloud like the hand of a man. That same hand is what wrote many, many tekle of our sin. Nebuchadnezzar, he stopped him from power. But this cloud began Elijah in power. It started the rain. This one stopped the rain. People of God, the hand of, of, of God you see is going to start you again in power. But also I realize that God uses the hands of men to do something. Whatever he wants to do, you have to use the hand of man. Like some men are going to give you money this week. Some men are going to give you jobs this week. Some men are going to give you cars this week. Oh, I command the hands of men to bless you. I command the hand of man to touch you. I command the hand of man to bless you. So I felt what we need to do is get a seed. Get a seed. Get a seed. Give me my Bible. I must have a seed there. You know, when in Bible, However small it is, he said it was like a hand of a man. Get a seed of a thousand, of, of ten thousand. Of, get a seed in your hand. Get a seed and run with it. And just drop it there. And God will multiply that one. I command hands of men to give you money in Jesus' name. Come on, get your seat, get your seat. Pastor David, bring the pastors who always help us with anointing the people. Quickly, quickly, man, I feel the anointing already. I feel the grace of God already. I knew I had a small seed. I knew some seed. And the seed of a hand of a man. Look at your seed. Look at your seed. So this is a little seed. It is in my hand. But it, it will attract billions in my life. Show in my life. Cars in my life. Oh, let me tell you, I know what I'm talking about. That seed, little seed you see in your hand, may God use it to bring abundance here of money. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Pastor David, where are the pastors? Maroko Shata Rababa Shandara Rababa. Reko Shatara Rababa. Tonight is a night like you've never seen before. Riboko Shatara Rababa. Rababa Baba Shatara Rababa Baba Bako Shatara Rababa. Ramama Mama Shandara Rababa. Come here quickly. In the name of Jesus, we give you praise, Father. That you anoint your people in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. I give you praise, Jesus. 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 What in the yes? Sharaba baba baba rabo kosha dara rabo. Rabo baba baba basha dara rabo rabo. Sharaba baba baba rabo kosha dara rabo. I feel the anointing of the Holy Ghost. Somebody lift up your hand and just laugh. Wani ke mikono seke. Hallelujah. 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 Glory, glory, glory. 
Jesus mighty name. Hallelujah. Let the fire and even you at home be anointed by the Holy Ghost. Be anointed by the blessings of God. May the Lord increase you. May the Lord add to you. May the Lord favor you. In Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Amen. Oh